these people move from South Dakota to Wisconsin, they absolutely love it. Except for a couple things. Taxes. But they've got 35 employees, and, and the owner, who's mid-40s or 40, said, I would hire three or four that are out there part-time right now. LT is I'd hire them full-time if I knew what the government was going to do. If I knew what the government was going to do. And that's just a small example. A business that far from here with 120 employees visited them. Again, two young owners doing a great job. They're international. Their sales are international. Wages are average or below, but they have what they consider a Cadillac health plan. Cadillac. He's afraid he's going to get taxed on that with his new health care bill. So guess what? They're hunkering down. They're not hiring people because they don't know what's going to happen. Biggest roadblock to growth in this country right now is the government, in my estimation. The uncertainty created by what's going on, especially in Washington and to a lesser extent in Madison, but we're really mirroring a lot of things in Madison that they're doing in Washington. I mean, not to the extent if they add a couple of zeros in Washington, that's all. That's the difference. But growing. Uh, the government and the massive spending is creating so much uncertainty out here that you know that you know individuals were saving more at a higher rate last year because they didn't want to spend money. They wouldn't buy that flat screen TV or a new car or whatever because they didn't know what was going to happen. And businesses are doing the same thing.